Hello friends, the sun is just poking up over the horizon and Raymond and I are out in the beautiful desert sunrise to do some very first testing on a camera that I have around my neck right now. And there are two other gear items that I am finishing up a review of and I want to talk about all three of those things in today's video and get any questions that you have and any last questions that you have on those items. But first, members, make sure that you check out Member Monday this week. I am, I vlogged this week, just kind of my work, different things that I did, different things that I did to prepare for work, different work items that I did. And if you are not a member, I will put a link in the description to find out more about channel membership. But if you are a member, there's a link down there for you to find Member Monday as well. First things first, this is the Hasselblad X1D250C, as well as the 45P lens. I have borrowed this from Hasselblad. This is the first medium format camera that I am using. I am super excited to be trying this out and I will share a review of it. I did also rent a lens uh, that has not arrived yet, but will be coming this coming week. And it is the 21 millimeter F4 lens. This is also an F4 lens in case you're curious. So what do you want to know about this guy? Uh, are, you, are you new to medium format and you want to know some things about medium format? You want to know what, what, what are the advantages? What's the big deal with medium format? Uh, or are you experienced in medium format and you want to know more about, you know, specific things about this camera? And what do you want to see me do with this camera? You know, what, what are situations that you'd like to see me put this guy in? And I will be sharing a review. I do have it for um, a few weeks, so I'm going to be shooting with it. Raymond and I actually have a really cool road trip planned this week, so stay tuned for that. And then the other two items that I am finishing up reviews of are the Fujifilm X100V and the Tamron 28 to 200 millimeter f 2.8 to 5.6 DI3 RXD. Both of the items, I mean, spoiler alert, I love both of them. I own the X100V, I have borrowed the Tamron lens, but I would be happy to shoot it any old time because I really like it. But I am doing the final preparations for my reviews of those two things. So let me get in any last questions that you have on them and that's going to be it for today. I hope that you all have a great week. Members, make sure you watch this week's Member Monday, link below. And I will also link to, to this guy and to the Fuji and the Tamron lens. So everything's in the description. Make sure you like this video if you want to give me some love and also subscribe if you haven't already. If you click the bell, you will be notified of any new videos that I release, including the review of this, the review of the Fuji X100V and the review of the Tamron 28 to 200. All very exciting things. I have tons of pictures to show you with those two items. And then this guy, I've already taken a bunch of pictures this morning, but I will be doing a lot in this uh, this road trip. I'm I'm really looking forward to it. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next one.